friends, welcome to my channel. So in this video, we will discuss the editorials of 12th July. Okay. And friends, uh, the important articles for today are high on rhetoric. So this article is all about Punjab drug issue. So we will discuss this article in detail. And Adi Madri, one more article is there with respect to the drug issue that is traffickers, peddlers, mulls or users. Even this happens to be an important article with respect to drugs. So number in the two articles, we combine money discuss discuss. And added to it, I will give you a few backgrounds that is the provisions which are there in our constitution in order to understand this article better okay so drug issue will be completed if you complete these two articles guys and ade madri matha article that is a uh a difficult campaign. Even this article is not important. Yana Pakistan la election at a kapogu, other base pan even the article, which is not important for us. And uh, added to it, caught in a cleft stick. So even this lead article is not important today. Fine. But however, a clean cooking strategy. So this article is important. Sila points in for panla number in the article. Lenda. So we will discuss this article. And Ade Mari, the problems with the higher education commissioner of India draft bill. So here can we number background the patrapo. So UGC, which is higher commission of India bill a base. And in the article, the crux that is the shortcomings of the bill so that you can add on points to that uh, article. Okay, and Ade Madri in FAQ that is with, with respect to NIPA virus. So, even this FAQ is important, we will discuss this FAQ. Fine, so coming to the first article high on rhetoric. So, Punjab la drug issue is there, drug addiction is there, and this uh, is government nariya steps. But however, it, it did not prove it to be fruitful. So why not fruitful Abdin Jolikating? It is like because nearly 30 people have died because of this drug issue or drug addiction. Abdin Goda Summa Solana. So government either response rend steps are the kanga unknown the solid kangana like they will bring in mandatory drug test for all the government employees including the police. So Yari Arla government officials so drug test first. Okay. And Ade Madri they have recommended the central government to bring in death penalty to drug peddlers. So peddlers na drug supply panranga so avangalukku death penalty kudukano abdin solitte sollirukanga abdin recommend pannirukanga okay now this article tries to say see what you are telling mandatory drug test to all the government employees including the police yes this happens to be a welcome move but ninga enna promise pannirundinga na archi la vanna odane ore maasathula drugs a wipe out pannido abdin sollirundinga ana ipo ninga edukra step enna drug test ah so this happens to be a small measure which is taken towards curbing the drug issue abdin solla varanga and added to it you have recommended death penalty to drug peddlers okay so either ninga curb pannuma abdin solte nanichinga no it will not curb because capital punishment is cruel it is hatred showing sort of hatred okay and uh, there is no evidence that bringing in hatred have decreased the crime so this is an empty signal abdin ranga so appo enna dhaan pa seiyano abdin solli kettingna here the article tries to give the solution adavud enna na in order to fight against these sort of uh, issues or drug war one need to do interventions into the community so on the community community kulla poi one need to spread awareness and they have to develop a culture against the usage of drugs so drugs edutha thappu abdin solta avangalude mindset la fix pannanuma appo da indha issue koravume thavara ninga death penalty eduthu vandinga nothing is going to happen abdin solti indha article solla varanga and added to it ipo ninga punjab eduthingna then the challenges which punjab face is huge and why abdin solti kettingna because we have facts and figures so if you take punjab then the people mindset over there is like nearly two third of the population in Punjab have a drug addicted mindset. Okay, so 66% of the population have a drug addict mindset. So you just imagine and add it to it. Punjab prisons, it is like overcrowded with the drug users and peddlers. And sorry, drugs is easily available in streets and in farms. So, where are you going? And last year, very young, 19,000 people have been arrested because of this drug supply and 2,000 treatment for the government. So, if you have facts and figures, if you drug issue eliminated, then it is going to be difficult. And added to it, this article tries to say, see, if you take this drug addiction or this drug issue in particular, then the main problem is that people benefiting from this drug supply are more. So, there are more profiters and they want 
this chain to sustain illana avanga tholil stop aidunga and ipo inda large scale drug supply nadakkudana then they will have a wide network and without government official support or secret support one cannot run this smoothly abdinu inda article la solla varanga okay so oru padam paatha mariye irukla but however this is the reality okay so this is the situation which is prevailing in punjab now one can ask a question sir why especially in punjab why not other state so here the article tries to give the reason geographically so enna solla varanga na you need to know something which is called as golden crescent so golden crescent happens to be the zone which are well known for their opm or drug production okay so world la there are two major zones one on the golden crescent in one on the golden triangle so golden crescent in the nations abdin solla kettingna here i would have shown you a map adavud iran pakistan afghanistan golden triangle vand burma thailand laos vietnam so these are the four countries of uh, triangle and uh, three nations of crescent okay and uh, they are famous for opium production ipo punjab has a porous border especially with pakistan so drugs vand easy a enter aidud punjab ku la that is via pakistan because pakistan happens to be a place of golden crescent and pakistan land easy a punjab ku la supply aidud drugs okay so this is one point and added to it if you look at the culture of the punjabis people then alcohol is a part of their life and added to it green revolution wealthiness of the farmers or also few things to have the sort of mindset okay so in the article enna solla varanga na ipo border mooliyamaga drugs supply aguduna then the state government has nothing to do in in this because the borders are protected by central security forces அதாவது பார்டர் செக்யூரிட்டி ஃபோர்ஸ் தான் பிஎஸ்எஃப் தான் இங்க ப்ரொடெக்ட் பண்ணணும்னு நினைக்கிறேன் சோ இட் இஸ் தேர் டியூட்டி டு ஸ்டாப் திஸ் and it is the central government who have to check these sort of issue and it is not the state government and added to it drugs in the oru valiyaga da varudha appdin solli kettingna kadaiyadu even via himachal pradesh synthetic drugs are supplied it seems okay so one needs to make sure that the border is properly fenced and uh, controlled so that the drug supply could be minimized and added to it punjab is such a place where drugs are supplied to the rest of the country ஓகே ஸோ பஞ்சாப் தான் ஹப் மாதிரி ட்ரக்ஸுக்கு அங்கிலிருந்து தான் மற்ற ஸ்டேட்ஸுக்கும் சப்ளை ஆகுது ஸோ திஸ் ஹேப்பன்ஸ் டு பி அ நேஷனல் செக்யூரிட்டி ட்ரெட் வை பிகாஸ் ட்ரக்ஸ் ஆர் அசோசியேட்டட் வித் டெரர் ஸோ ட்ரக்ஸ் சப்ளை எங்கெங்கெல்லாம் இருக்கோ அங்கே டெரர் ஈஸியாக ப்ரிவேல் ஆகிடும் ஓகே ஸோ தீஸ் ஆர் ஃபியூ இஷ்யூஸ் அண்ட் ஆடட் டு இட் திஸ் அடிக்கல் ட்ரைஸ் டு டாக்ஸ் அபவுட் பொலிட்டீஷியன் ஸோ என்ன சொல்ல வராங்கன்னா பொலிட்டீஷியன் ஷுட் ஆல்சோ பிளே அண்ட் இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் ரோல் இன் ஆர்டர் டு ஸ்டாப் தி சார்ட் ஆஃப் ட்ரக்ஸ் ட்ரீட் ஓகே ஸோ இட் இஸ் நாட் லைக் இன் ஆர்டர் டு வின் அ எலெக்ஷன் ஆர் இன் ஆர்டர் டு கெயின் தி பாப்புலாரிட்டி சும்மா speech kudutha or uh, word play la one can win abdin la illa they need to involve themselves and they need to bring in a proper solution so that uh, drug supply could be stopped so even politician has an important role abdin solla varanga yes obviously so politician people are influential people so even they can influence a people to an extent okay fine so i hope it is clear to you so in the article lenda namba enna points infer pannala abdin solla kettingna first the recent action which is taken by the punjab government in order to curb the drug trade or drug issue and uh, punjab la problems romba adhigama irukku that is two third of the population of punjab have a drug addict mindset and added to it this happens to be an uh, profit business making for many and why punjab alone abdin solli kettingna it is golden crescent and uh, porous borders kaga central security forces da steps edukonume thavara it is not the state government and added to it this also poses national security threat plus politician should also play an important role so that they could win the war on drugs fine so chuma propaganda pandradhu vittu bring in a proper uh, effective steps abdinu politician kitta solranga okay so these are the few points which we can infer from the article and ipo nama enna seivona we will see the acts which have been bought by the central government in order to stop the sort of drugs or drug trade okay and india la idukaga eduthu vandadhu da narcotic drugs and psychotropic substances act 1985 ஓகே ஸோ பார்லிமெண்ட்டில் நைன்டீன் எயிட்டி ஃபைவ்ல இந்த ஆக்டை பாஸ் பண்ணாங்க அதாவது என்டிபிஎஸ் ஆக்ட் ஸோ இந்த ஆக்டோடைய கிரக்ஸ் என்ன அப்படின்னு சொல்லி கேட்டிங்கன்னா திஸ் ப்ரொஹிபிட்ஸ் ஆர் ஸ்டாப்ஸ் அ பர்சன் டு ப்ரொடியூஸ் மேனுஃபேக்சர் கல்டிவேட் செல் பர்ச்சேஸ் டிரான்ஸ்போர்ட் ஸ்டோர் ஆர் கன்சியூம் எனி நர்காட்டிக் ட்ரக் ஆர் சைக்கோட்ராபிக் சப்ஸ்டன்ஸ் ஸோ சைக்கோட்ராபிக் சப்ஸ்டன்ஸ்னா எனி திங் விச் அஃபெக்ட்ஸ் யுவர் மென்டல் ஸ்டெபிலிட்டிஸ் ஆர் சம்திங் லைக் தட் ஓகே ஸோ சிம்பிளாக சொல்லணும்னா ட்ரக் போதை பொருள் இதை ஸ்டாப் பண்ணுறது ஆர் இதை ப்ரொஹிபிட் பண்ணுறது தான் இந்த ஆக்டோட Yeah, in and this was bought in 1985 and in the act a moonwati am 
amendment that is in 88 2001 and 2014 and this act applies to the whole of India that is to all the Indian citizens and also on those people who have registered themselves in India okay and uh, internationally India have signed the three convention that is convention on narcotic drugs convention on psychotropic substance and uh, UN convention against illicit traffic in narcotic drugs and psychotropic substances 1988 so the UN convention and in the moon UN convention India signed money record so this act is an implementation to these three conventions so we are bounded internationally also in order to stop drug trafficking or uh, drug supply or drug usage so internationally in our United Nations we are signatory so we need to pass a law so that's why the law pass so fine I hope you got the point and uh, again in the act it prohibits total drugs so yes but however for medical and scientific purpose one can use the drugs so okay so medicine and scientific purpose kaga one can promote the use of drugs but however for illegal sources or for illegal traffic or for abusing this cannot be utilized and Ademari you must be knowing about a body which is called as narcotics control bureau which is under ministry of home affairs okay so in the body in the act established pannanga and this narcotics control bureau will coordinate actions of various uh, functions of central and state government so central government to state government to in the act in the solar Central government will regulate the cultivation, production, manufacture, import, export, sale, consumption of all the sort of drugs and psychotropic drugs. So, in the drugs, they will use this rules. They will regulate. And state government is also has a say in this act. Adavadu, they are empowered to permit or to regulate certain type of drugs like opium, poppy straw, mari medicinal opium, cannabis. So, in the mari certain drugs possess panala abdini solta, they can bring in rules. But however, illegal cultivation of this uh, cannabis and uh, poppy are offense. And added to it, this acts bring, bring many stringent punishment or uh, harsh punishment and uh, this act is considered as one of the harsh act in the country so why abdin solikating na ipo in the act kila or the matic naran vengla then he can be jailed for 10 years added to it or la charba fine vara seringla so this is the severity of the act if you take human trafficking or rape, that's why you are in jail. And drugs are in jail. And added to it, in the act, you are in jail. And in the act, you are in jail. No relief will be there. That's why if you are in jail, then the president has the power to remit the sentence or to commute the sentence. And this is not in jail. That's why you are in jail. Okay. And added to it, this act prescribes capital punishment for repeat offenders of drug trafficking. Okay, so, one of the punishments you can get If you don't get the act, then capital punishment you can get the act. Okay, so, this happens to be a very harsh act. But however, government is saying, you consider International Narcotics Control Board. So, even International Narcotics Control Board is there. So, you can do death penalty object panala because this is the severity of the situation. You can claim the government. Okay. And that's why in the act, there are provisions that are basically not going But however, the points which I gave you is important. Okay. So coming to the article now, that is traffickers, peddlers or users. So in the article, let us tell you that now Punjab la cabinet meeting and they have recommended for death penalty. But however, in the matter of harsh punishment is not going to be fruitful because if you look at the history, then capital punishment has not succeeded. Abdin Solavaranga. And this is true with especially with respect to Narcotic Drugs and Psychotropic Substance Act 1985. And added to it, this article tries to say, see, India la drugs are based on law or the NDPS Act. That is NDPS Act 1985. And it's already a primary objective is to stop drug trafficking or to reduce drug trafficking and in this case stringent provisions are there like liability offense that is the fines and that is the minimum sentence 10 years in jail death penalty so you can get stringent punishments yes but however you see the facts and figures in 2015 nearly about 42% of the people are convicted under the act and if you go to Patiala that is especially in Punjab the conviction rate is 90% it seems but Indian Penal Code are based on the convict of drugs case lab denied is only 30 percentage. Okay, so this is what we know. Another act of stringent provisions, the conviction rate is high and added to it, Punjab is the issue. 
and added to it the article tries to say see idella death penalty kuda irukku which was introduced in the year 1989 so namm yerkane paathirpom ndps act was amended so 1989 la narco terrorism kaga death penalty eduthirundirukanga so narco terrorism na terrorism linking with drugs or narcotics idhu da narco terrorism so idha stop pandradhukaga death penalty eduthirundirukanga and appo the government what they believed is the only way to stop these sort of uh, narco terrorism or uh, drug trafficking or uh, drug abuses by bringing in harsh punishment so adukaga da 10 varsham jail la eduthu vandirukanga and inga you need to know one more point that is this jail term is also for commercial quantities of drug adavadhu under this act if a person possess certain quantities of drugs and that to based on the commercial value fine so and the drugs ku or commercial value irukum and if the person possess more commercial quantity then he can be sentenced to jail or he can be assumed as drug trafficker but inga department of revenue bought in a notification and adula avanga enna sonnanga na while calculating the commercial value of the drug and giving punishment to a particular person many of them were not involved in trafficking offenses at all fine so what the official do is when they ride a house they just look at the weight of the drug and on the weight of the drug based panni they place a commercial value and or person a punish panniranga or convict panniranga but this is not the truth one needs to see the content or the pure content of the drug which is available and other based panni da commercial value place pananum abindranga and idha based panni pharmaceutical drug companies or drug cases la irundhadu illaya idhula kuda or drastic ana changes theriya vandhadu and pattiyala la ஒருத்தர் வந்து இருபது பாட்டில் சிரப் வச்சிருந்தார காப்ஸ் சிரப் அதுக்காக அவங்கள ஜெயிலில் தூக்கி போட்டாங்களா இந்த ஆக்ட் கீழே ஸோ இந்த ஆக்டோட சிவியாரிட்டியை பார்த்து ஒன் கெனாட் சே வெதர் ஈஸ் அ டிராஃபிக்கர் பெட்லர் ஆர் ஈஸ் அன் யூசர் and added to it this article tries to say see idoda provisions are so stringent that if under this law anyone has a drug or anyone uh, possess drugs with himself abdinna then alaga police avara pudichittu he can be convicted very easily because it is very hard to prove the intent why he has kept the drug so on the intention of the keeping the drugs or edukaga avar indha drugs ah vechirkara abdin solittu prove pandrathu romba kashtam under this act so punjab la just or charge sheet police file panna podum a person can easily convict it seems so ad criminal act aga irukalam or uh, the nature of possession idella paakradhe kadaiyadu and without it how can we see or how can we get to know that the particular person is such abindranga so if a cabinet proposal to make or recommendation to make death sentence is just a play to the gallery so chuma peer kaga act pandra mari irukke but however the real solution to this is you need to act on the opposite side so opposite approach eduthu varano so users vittu neenga first traffickers ah pidikano adhe mari or thara inda law kila prosecute pandringa or convict pandringa then you need to provide adequate proof appo da ஒருத்தர் வந்து அஃபென்சிவ் அப்படின்னு சொல்லிட்டு என்ன சொல்லிருக்காங்க or any offence done under this act will be a criminal offence abdin sollirukanga so criminal offence kaga no one will come for treatment so if a worker addict avararna then one should decriminalize addiction so addiction is different trafficking is different so namba enna seiyanona we need to develop an effective treatment strategy adhe mari we have to bring in many ngos or partner agencies and users and we should be providing adequate resources to them so that uh, addiction should be minimized so namba infrastructure la invest pananum idu விட்டுட்டு ரூல்ஸ் ஆஸ் ஸ்ட்ரிஞ்சன் பண்ண கூடாது அப்படி சொல்லிட்டு இந்த ஆர்டிக்கல்ல சொல்லி முடிச்சறாங்க ஓகே சோ ஐ ஹோப் திஸ் ஆர்டிக்கல் இஸ் கிளியர் டு அண்ட் ஈவன் தி ப்ரொவிஷன்ஸ் கூட ஈஸியா புரிஞ்சிருக்கும் நினைக்கிறேன் ஓகே சோ ட்ரை டு மேக் a நோட் ஆஃப் இட் அண்ட் இஃப் யூ நோ எனி अदर பாயிண்ட்ஸ் வித் ரெஸ்பெக்ட் டு திஸ் ஆக்ட் which you feel important please mention that in the comment box or in the telegram group okay so coming to the next article a clean cooking strategy so in the article is all about cooking fuel which is used in the household so enna solla varanga na energy use is a key indicator of living standard and adhe madri india la household expenditure அப்படினு சொல்லிட்டு பாத்தீங்கன்னா அதாவது एवरेज हाउसहोल्ड एक्सपेंडिचर ऑफ ऑल அப்படினு சொல்லிட்டு பாத்தீங்கன்னா இட் இஸ் லைக் नियरली 5 टू 6 परसेंटेज इज स्पेंट ऑन कुकिंग फ्यूल इट सीम्स सो मेनी फैक्टर्स डिटरमाइंस द कुकिंग फ्यूल लाइक द कल्चर द लाइफस्टाइल देयर इनकम देयर एक्सेसिबिलिटीज एंड गवर्नमेंट पॉलिसीज सो दिस इन्फ्लुएंस कुकिंग फ्यूल इन इंडिया एंड ऐडेड टू इट यूजिंग क्लीन एनर्जी फॉर कुकिंग इज इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर हैविंग गुड हेल्थ एज वेल एज रिड्यूसिंग द एनवायरमेंटल इंपैक्ट्स அப்படிங்கறாங்க 
So this article tries to compare cooking fuels option. So in a solar varangna, if you take cooking fuel, then they can be classified into firewood, pellets, biogas, kerosene, LPG, that is liquefied petroleum gas and piped natural gas. So in the or anji aru vidamaga cooking fuel la classify panirkanga. Now what I want you to do is please write down in the comment box what is the difference between LPG and PNG. So PNG NG refers to natural gas. Okay, and LPG that is liquefied petroleum gas which consists of propane and butane. And many differences are there between the two. That is with reference with reference to their efficiency and so on so i want you to write that in the comment box so in the article enna solla varanga na if you consider all then biogas is the best fuel abindranga why because it account for lower greenhouse gas emission and iduk next varradhu dhaan png and lpg abindranga so if you take a survey that is a annual life cycle emission of all these fuel abdin solla neenga paathinga then biogas is the best abindranga adhe maadhiri cost abdin solla paatha kuda biogas is cheaper then png is cheaper and adukaprana lpg abindranga and added to it idukku mela cooking fuels irukna then they amount to toxic pollutants like uh, carbon monoxide nitrogen benzene sulfur so idella pollutants of uh, cooking fuels which also contributes to indoor air pollution and uh, affects the health in household so simple as solla ponona biogas and natural gas are best fuels they are cleaner fuels for combustion and idhuk next paathinga na lpg and kerosene are moderately cleaner abindranga okay now we know that natural gas and biogas are best and ipo inda article enna solla varanga na india la to ensure that one needs to have clean cooking fuels sila initiatives eduthu vandirukanga and one of the initiatives is national project on biogas development so idu vandu 1980s la eduthu vandirukanga but however due to poor construction material lack of maintenance or proper accountability illadadanaala and adhe mari service follow up service olunga kudukadadanaala this proved to be a failure and again in order to bring in clean energy in 2016 the government bought in a program which is called as pradhan mantri ujwala yojana so in the ujwala yojana la we gave lpg connections to more than 8 crore families it seems and adhe madri petroleum and natural gas regulatory board what they are doing is they are holding auctions for the distribution of gas for cooking through png that is piped natural gas so natural gas pipe mulyamaga kudukkaradhukaga they are giving auction so this article what they are trying to say is ipo we know that biogas and png is better than lpg but however government is subsidizing only for lpg but not for biogas and png so lpg cylinders ku dhaan preference kudukranga adha ujwala yojana which is less effective than biogas and added to it ipo inda lpg cylinders mela subsidies kudukkaradhanaala government ku deficit kuda agudhu like the government is pumping a huge sum of amount because they are giving large subsidies so enna seiyala appdi solla kettingna we need to promote biogas and especially in rural and semi urban areas so idukaga we need to bring in service to based enterprises model with a suitable resource availability office for sustainable approach appindranga so enna solranga na ipo eppadi lpg gas cylinders connection kudukrangalo adhe mari png kagayum or biogas kagayum indha mari service enterprises model namba eduthu varanum and indha mari model yerkanave punjab la implement pannirukanga and it was like quite successful also and indha mari or model eduthu vandanga definitely employment generation will be there that is at the grassroots level and added to it we also will have the benefit of running a biogas program but however what is required is the financial support and the capacity building that is technologically adaptive uh, solutions eduthu varanum in order to promote these sort of enterprises plus this article tries to say see cost competitiveness abdin solla pathinga natural gas is cheaper than petroleum natural gas as well as lpg so enna seiyanona one needs to fix an higher price of uh, lpg so that even in urban areas people will prefer natural gas or liquefied natural gas or even piped natural gas so lpg rate adhigama veinga so that the user will have an option to choose the other one and idukaga neenga subsidies um kudunga that is in order to replace uh, these sort of natural gas even the government can give subsidies on the basis of household income levels and uh, taking into consideration varieties of factors and ide mari you can have a say that uh, in the mari or business enterprises model irundadana then it will amount to leakages appdi neenga solringa na idukaga neenga enna pannunga na direct benefit transfer kudunga so that the subsidies will be directly given to the household those who are shifting it okay so idanaala leakages kuda kammi aayidum so simple ah enna solla varanga na ipo namba lpg kaga என்னென்ன எடுத்துட்டு வந்தோமோ उज्ज्वला स्कीम एलपीजी डायरेक्ट बेनिफिट ट्रांसफर இது எல்லாத்தையும் நேச்சுரல் গ্যাসஸ் காக்கு கொடுங்க அப்படினு சொல்ல வராங்க and uh, india has a long term view on sustainability and energy security so it is also important that we are aware of the option which is available and we are also aware of the energy choices which is available biogas and uh, natural gas are the better option அப்படினு சொல்லிட்டு இந்த ஆர்டிகல்ல முடிச்சிடுறாங்க okay so in the article oda crux அப்படினு சொல்லிட்டு பாத்தீங்கனா many fuels are there 
பைப்டு நேச்சுரல் கேஸ் அண்ட் பயோ கேஸ் ஆர் பெட்டர் அண்ட் இதுலேயும் பயோ கேஸ் தான் மோஸ்ட் எஃபிஷியன்ட் கிளீன் எனர்ஜி அண்ட் காஸ்ட் வைஸ் கூட ரொம்ப சீப் பட் ஹவ் அவர் இந்தியாவில் எல்பிஜி பென்ட்ரேஷன் தான் அதிகமாக இருக்கு அண்ட் இன் ஸ்பைட் ஆஃப் அ கவர்மெண்ட் பிரிங்கிங் அண்ட் மெனி ஸ்கீம்ஸ் லைக் நேச்சுரல் ப்ராஜெக்ட் ஆன் பயோ கேஸ் டெவலப்மெண்ட் இட் ப்ரூவ் டு பி அ ஃபெயிலியர் பட் ஹவ் அவர் இப்போ உஜ்வாலா யோஜனா வந்திருக்கு அண்ட் அதில் எல்பிஜி பெனிட்ரேஷன் ஹவ் பின் இன்க்ரீஸ் ஸோ ஏ த ஆர்த்த ட்ரைஸ் டு சே நீங்கள் எல்பிஜியை விட நேச்சுரல் கேஸ் அண்ட் பயோ கேஸஸ்க்கு வந்து அதிகமான ட்ரஸ்ட் கொடுங்க ஸோ சப்சிடிஸ் கொடுங்க எல்பிஜியோட ரேட் ஏற்றுங்க அதே மாதிரி ஒரு பிஸ்னஸ் மாடல் என்டர்பிரைசஸ் எடுத்துருவாங்க ஸோ தட் ஈவன் எம்ப்ளாய்மெண்ட் ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டிஸ் குட் பி டன் அண்ட் இந்த மாதிரி ஒரு ப்ராஜெக்ட் நம்ம ஏற்கனவே பஞ்சாப்ல பண்ணியிருக்கோம் விச் இஸ் குவைட் சக்சஸ்ஃபுல் ஆல்சோ ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் அ கிரீனர் ஃபியூவல் அண்ட் ஈவன் த காஸ்ட் காம்படிட்டிவ்னஸ் will give a edge when compared to lpg okay so these are the main important points which one can infer from this article okay so that's it with respect to this article friends we'll move on to the next article that is an faq with respect to nifa virus so kerala government has announced that nifa virus அதாவது த அவுட் பிரேக் ஆஃப் நீஃபா வைரஸ் ஆஸ் ஹெண்டட் அண்ட் கோசிகோட் அண்ட் மலப்புரம் டிஸ்ட்ரிக்ட் வந்து நீஃபா ஃப்ரீ அப்படின்னு சொல்லிட்டு அனௌன்ஸ் பண்ணிட்டாங்க நவ் இதுதான் லேட்டஸ்ட் நியூஸ் பட் ஹவ் அவர் ஒன் நீட்ஸ் டு நோ தட் திஸ் நீஃபா வைரஸ் எப்படி ஸ்ப்ரெட் ஆகுது அப்படின்னு சொல்லிட்டு தெரியணும் ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் ஸ்ப்ரெட் பை பேட்ச் அண்ட் அதுலேயுமே ஃப்ரூட் பேட்ச் அப்படின்னு சொல்ல வராங்க ஸோ ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் யூ மஸ்ட் பி நோயிங் லைக் வவ்வால் வந்து ரெண்டு வகைப்படும் ஒன்று வந்து ஃப்ரூட் பேட் அதாவது பழம் சாப்பிட்டு வாழ்ற வவ்வாலுங்க இன்னொன்று வந்து இன்செக்ஸை சாப்பிட்டு வாழ்ற வவ்வாலுங்க ஸோ ஃப்ரூட் பேட்ச் இருக்கு தெரியுமா தே ஸ்ப்ரெட் நீஃபா வைரஸ் and especially the cosigot fruit batch has the virus in them so that anga uh, outbreak nadandirukku okay and added to it idu eppadi spread aachu appdi solta theriyaradhe illa adhavud predict pandradhu romba kashtam so we need to have a health care surveillance so or proper check vechikano in order to prevent the sort of circulation because this can spread without our knowledge appdi nranga and added to it seri ipo kerala la nadandirukku vera states la varuma appdi solta kettingna or idhe mari outbreaks varuma appdi solli kettingna see ipodike kerala and west bengal ஃப்ரூட் பேட்ச்ல தான் இந்த நீஃபா அவுட் பிரேக்ஸ் கண்டுபிடிக்கப்பட்டிருக்கு அண்ட் இங்க தான் ஸ்ப்ரெட் ஆயிருக்கு பட் ஹவ் அவர் அசாம் பேட்ச்லயும் இல்ல ஹரியானா பேட்ச் நீங்க எடுத்து பாத்தீங்கன்னா கூட அங்க கூட நீஃபா வைரஸோட ஸ்ட்ரெயின்ஸ் இருக்கு சோ எஸ் இட் கேன் ஸ்ப்ரெட் பட் இது வரையும் இந்த அவுட் பிரேக் ஹேப்பன்ட் இன் வெஸ்ட் பெங்கால் அண்ட் கேரளா சோ இட் ஹேஸ் தி பொட்டன்ஷியல் டு ஸ்ப்ரெட் இன் அதர் ஸ்டேட்ஸ் ஆல்சோ ஓகே அண்ட் ஆடட் டு இட் சி வாட் இஸ் த மெத்தட் ஆஃப் டிரான்ஸ்மிஷன் அப்படினு சொல்லி கேக்குறாங்க சோ இத்தனை வருஷமா ஃப்ரூட் பேட்ச்ல இருந்திருக்கு இந்த நீஃபா வைரஸ் சோ இதுக்கு முன்னாடி ஏன் நடக்கல சோ வை நவ் அப்படினு சொல்லி கேட்டிங்கனா இட் இஸ் லைக் First of all, you need to know, first of all, the transmission is a rare process. So, if you want to go to the transfer, it's okay. And in that case, in the Nifa virus, I have been there in nations which have never seen an outbreak before, like Thailand, Malaysia, Bangladesh and India. So, in these countries, there is no outbreak. But now, we are feeling it. So, in India, what is the reason for India? It is like deforestation and urbanization. So, because of deforestation and urbanization, bats come in close contact with the humans. And in that case, there is no outbreak. 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 madri the bat need to carry a lot of virus with themselves so which is a rare phenomena so close contactness adhe mari the bat must carry a lot of virus in the two phenomena irundha da idu spread aagradhukana vaippugal irukku so adu kerala la nadandirukla so adanalu outbreak aayirukalam seri ella edathilum idhe mari da nadakudha appdi solli kettingna kadai adu malaysia la panniya la spread aacha idu so what the pig used to did is like uh, it consumed the bat bitten fruit and through the pigs it spread to human so panni gari saavada koodadhu and i added to that in bangladesh a person drank a, a juice of a fruit in which the bat has urinated so even bangladesh la abdi spread a irukku so spreading ipdi da abdi solta solradhukku illa but however when bats come in close contact with human then spreading ku vaippu irukku okay so why there is a global interest abdi solli kettingna because it has the potential to go global okay see ipodike in the virus odey spreading vandu inefficient ah da irukku because proper ana mutation illa that is the mutation between the virus is not there and it is not becoming airborne so kaathala paravarudhu illa oru sick patient irukkarana oru pagathla pona பரவிறது ரெஸ்பிரேட்டரி டிராப்லெட்ஸ் மூலியமாக பரவுறது ஸோ இதெல்லாம் இப்போ ரொம்ப கம்மியாக இருக்குது பட் ஹவ் அவர் எங்கெங்கெல்லாம் அவுட் பிரேக்ஸ் நடந்திருக்கோ அங்கே மியூட்டேஷன் அழகாக நடக்கும் ஸோ இட் ஹேஸ் தி சான்சஸ் டு ஸ்ப்ரெட் ஸோ அதனால இட் ஹேஸ் தி பொட்டன்ஷியல் டு பிகம் குளோபல் அப்படின்னு இந்த ஆர்டிக்கலில் சொல்கிறாங்க ஓகே ஸோ இந்த ஆர்டிக்கலில் நீஃபானா என்ன ஃப்ரூட்ஸ் பேட் மூலியமாக இது பரவும் அண்ட் த ரீசன் இஸ் க்ளோஸ் கான்டாக்ட்னஸ் அண்ட் பேட்ஸ் ஹேவிங் லாட் ஆஃப் வைரஸ் லோட் வித் தம் செல்ஃப் ப்ளஸ் இட் கேன் பிகம் அ மேஜர் எபிடமிக் globally also fine so these are the important points which we can infer from this